chicks. Are we gonna win this game? We are definitely gonna win. We, we are gonna win this game. Yeah, you're gonna put up the I reckon so. Fantastic. And we're gonna get you before the shots. Yes. Matt, how are you doing? Yeah, good. How are you feeling? Huh? Feeling good? Yeah, great, yeah. You gonna score some bangers? Of course. <laughs> We are ready. How are you doing, Ralph? I am good. Ready to win. Ready to win, yeah? Cool. Wait, any thoughts? Ready any thoughts? Ready to smoke. Ready? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> so it is now 7.01. Uh, Castle Balotelli versus Top Lads of Lichu, top of the division. And we're playing for uh, to take, take first place, basically. So uh, let's see. Let's see how this goes. Come on. I'm pumped. Welcome back to the Cusper Balotelli channel. It gives me great pleasure to say that the football and dentists are finally back playing football. After a few months in lockdown, our leagues have finally restarted, so we're back playing football. But not only that, we've got a new kit. As you can see, the boy is looking lovely in that. Sponsored by KCL Dental Society and Dental Protection. Make sure you drop a like on the video if you're rating our new kit. And if you're new, make sure you subscribe to the channel. This week's match is against the official top lads of Litchfield, who are currently sitting on top of the table. We're both on five wins out of five, but they're just ahead of us on goal difference. Last time we played them was way back in our first season when we made their keeper rage quit. Check that video out if you haven't already. Starting today's game though, is Kai and goal, myself, Samir, Matt and Wilf. Indirect free kick here early doors for us and Matt tries a cheeky one but unfortunately it's not going to count because like I said it's indirect. So in fiver side you're not allowed to slide and I don't know about you but this next one looks like a slide to me. So we find ourselves 1-0 down early doors, ref should have disallowed that goal for a slide but he didn't and there's another one. You know them ones when you accidentally open your front camera and you catch yourself off guard. I got the ball at the back here and I can't find a pass at all. Eventually this guy presses me enough and I lose the ball. I just wanted to let you know, I want to warn you right now. This guy here in the Brazil top, number 10, looking like William. Baller. Ball eventually rolls on through to their keeper and he tries to roll it out. But Matt's going to win the challenge really high up the pitch and Wolf's going to finish. One one now, but Litchfield straight from the kickoff are through on goal. Litchfield coming forward again now, and they pass the ball to Willian. I make the first challenge. Somehow he manages to keep the ball. He ends up on the deck, but still manages to keep the ball. He comes forward and gets the shot away, but it's just wide. He wants to show you. He wants to show you. Wilf tries a little turn here. It doesn't quite come off, but he gets lucky, and we get a couple of shots away from it. Uh, it eventually leads to an indirect free kick. Matt's going to take it. He's going to square straight to Wolf. Wolf's going to shoot, but the keeper's going to save. Wolf's going to sell this guy a pair of new retainers, and then he almost does a madness. Oh. Oh. Our free kick here, but Matt gives the ball away to the opposition. They get the shot away, but Kai makes the save. Oh, what a save. Kai on the ball here, he rolls out to Matt. Matt loses out on the turn, uh, but he doesn't give up. He comes back on the recovery. Eventually, he's going to make this interception here and drive forward. He gets the ball to Wilf. Wilf gets the shot, but the keeper makes a save. Matt tries to follow in on it. Wilf gives the ball to him, but he can't quite get his foot on it. Litchfield come forward now with the ball here, and the first shot gets blocked by Wilf, but the second shot falls to their talisman. Great left footed finish from Willian there, it's our centre kick, Wolf's going to pass the ball back to me but I give it straight back to them, it's very poor from me, he takes it past two and gets the chance, I think it pings off the crossbar, we don't get so lucky on the second time though. And within the blink of an eye we're 3-1 down now and with that we make the first sub of the day, Samir's off, Muid's on, meanwhile Matt's trying to injure their best player. Oh. Oh. 
Indirect free kick for us here, I make a nice overlapping run and Matt finds me and I get lucky off the post. Oh! What a goal! Beauty! Ah oh, yes, back in my day we used to have the square posts and a lot more used to come out than go in, believe me. What a great goal for the young lad. That goal makes it 3-2, but Litchfield aren't messing around today and straight from kickoff they make it 4-2. I've been calling him William so far, but I think I need to start putting some respect on his name. His name's actually Khalid and he's a lovely guy, but he's an even better footballer. If I'm not wrong, I think he's scored all of their goals so far as Litchfield come forward again with a nice pass. This guy passes it back to Khalid. Khalid finds a pass out wide. Kai makes a save from the shot. But like the DJ, Khalid scores. Another one. This guy's scoring too many goals. It's a bit of a baller. Alright. So I... This guy's a baller. This guy is a bit of a baller. These guys are top of the league for a reason and it clearly shows as we're struggling at the beginning of this first half as Kai makes a nice save. Khalid here has got the key to Wolf's legs apparently. Litchfield on the ball here and we make the block of the first shot and you might not be able to see this one but the second one is actually a great save down to Kai's right. Ooh, save. Matt's shot gets blocked here and again it's probably a slide from William but he comes forward and this time he finds the assist. Yeah. 6-2 down now and it's quite clear that we're not at the levels that we were at before the lockdown as Samir's back on the pitch now, um, Wolf's battling for the ball here and the ref thinks it's a foul. Matt intercepts the ball high up the field here, uh, but William keeps battling, sorry, Khalid keeps battling. Uh, that's got to be a foul there, but the ref doesn't give it. Litchfield come forward now, they find a couple of nice passes. Khalid passes the ball over, he shoots, he scores, 7-2. Straight from kickoff here though, now watch this. Good goal! Really well worked goal from us there, but then just look at this from Khalid. This guy really is just controlling the game ever so elegantly in that Brazil number 10 top. He really does deserve to wear it. Litchfield tried to pass forward though. Moeed intercepts it, passes to Samir. Samir finds Moeed and Moeed tries to drive down the line. Eventually nothing comes of it though. Unfortunately for us, it falls to Willian again, and I think at this point, Wolf just needs to stay away from him. No pressure on the Litchfield shot here from us, but luckily we've got Kaiengo and he makes a fine save. Come on, boys, it's halfway, you've got to engage it there. Litchfield relentless on the attacks here as they come forward again. The ball breaks free for Willian, but this time Wolf and Samir together do enough. Samir in the blue number 10 shirt here makes a very nice overlapping run but Wilf doesn't find him in time. Samir though, he recovers well and blocks off the shot from Willian. Willian has to find the pass, Litchfield still with the ball though. Eventually it goes overhead and it's an indirect free kick. Kai switched on from the indirect free kick here and he makes a good save from the snap shot. Kai makes another very good save here but unfortunately it's just out of shot. Good save. Almost half time now and the last action of the half is yet another goal from Willian. Will! Tom Will! Will drop into the middle. Get Will to drop into the middle. Oi. I feel like Will is... Oi, I feel like Will is wasted up front. Alright. 
They're pretty good, yeah, they're pretty good. Okay, so second half's gonna get underway now and I'm gonna treat you to a new beat from the man, Mazni Beats. This one's called Ballin'. Just appreciate this drop. As you heard at half time, Kai said that number 10, William Khalid, doesn't even play for them. So what he meant by that is basically Khalid is a ringer. What that means is when you don't have enough players, you contact Power League and they'll sort out a player for you. And luckily for these guys, Litchfield, the player that they got is this absolute baller Khalid. So at half time, we decided it might be a good idea to man mark Khalid. Um, so you're going to see me in this half literally just following him around as much as possible as Matt gets fouled there on the edge of the box. We're 8-3 down at the moment, but we've been five goals down before and we've made the comeback successfully. And it's five aside, so anything could happen. Matt eventually takes the free kick here and he finds Wilf, the shot gets blocked and it goes overhead again so it's another indirect free kick for us. I try to take it quickly here, I find Matt but his shot gets blocked out and eventually nothing comes of it. Samir in the blue number 10 shirt here with a free kick forward finds Matt, uh, Matt loses the ball, he can't find his pass and William lets us off. Wilf on the ball here and he finds Samir on the left. Samir looks down the line and he finds Matt with a nice pass. Samir makes the run forward but Matt can't quite find him. Like I said earlier, I'm man marking their number 10 here and we managed to dispossess him here. Matt gets the snap shot away but the keeper makes a good save with his feet. I get the ball, um, I go for a turn. The turn's good but the shot isn't. Wilf in the number 9 here. Reads the play very well, intercepts the forward pass from the yellows. Does a very nice touch to turn, but he can't finish. The yellow's gonna come forward on the counter attack here though, as they string together a few nice passes. Here's William on the ball, he passes out to the right. They find another good pass there, pass across. One more pass across, but Wolf slides to make the challenge. Good finish from Wolf there, but that's not gonna count because of the slide, so it's an indirect free kick to the yellows. They shoot, it gets deflected and then it goes in. It is looking a bit peak at the moment for the boys, I can't lie, obviously it's our first game back after lockdown and it's looking like a few of us at the moment are still in lockdown. We're on the ball here though, that's Wilf, passes to Matt, Matt loses out in the challenge now, the yellows are on the ball. They go back to their keeper but eventually they do try to come forward, I give this guy a shove off the ball and it ends up with a Wilf shot but that's never going in. You can't quite see it here, but I can confirm that this was a save with Kai's right foot. The ball then breaks forward to Matt. Matt has a go, but it's blocked. And now Samir is going to give you a live summary from pitch side of the game so far. <sighs> Alright. <clears throat> so, I finally kind of caught my breath. So if you give a little summary. Um... I don't really think we're doing this yeah. I don't know if we're a little bit of a... I can't speak, I can't speak. I don't know why I'm <sighs> Okay. Oh! Is that a goal? Mud! I think we scored there. Very nice. Yes, sir. Yes, Samir, that was a goal and it's a nice one from Matt, his second of the day, and that makes it 9-4 through the keeper's legs. Lovely. It's actually very difficult having to man-mark someone who's such a good footballer, but also they're making so many good movements and they're always running. It's very tiring. It's kind of like when Herrera did it against uh, Chelsea when he man-marked Hazard and completely pocketed him. But for now, I'm doing a good job. He's been quite quiet this half so far as Wilf wins the challenge here. Matt gets the pass across. I shoot, but the keeper makes a fantastic save. Oh, I almost dropped my camera. It was a filthy tackle! Filthy! ref. Personally, I wouldn't say that was a filthy tackle. I think it was a very good tactical foul from Matt. Anyway, we move, they take the free kick. Williams on the ball here. We're trying to deal with him. Between the both of us, myself and Weed, we do enough basically. They're passing it back all the way. They get a shot away, but it's wide. Ball breaks free to Matt eventually. 
He takes his time with the shot, eventually it gets deflected wide though. Indirect free kick for us over in the corner there, Matt's over it, he passes to Wilf but his shot's tame. Balls with the keeper now and he rolls out to one of the yellows who comes forward but Moid makes the block. I went to the park the other day and I saw a rugby player practicing their conversion kicks. It looks something like this. <sighs> Khalid hasn't been so active this second half but luckily when he has been, we've been able to rely on Kai. Oh. Back at it again. What a save. Yellow's coming forward here and it's a nice one-two around Muid, but he doesn't give it up. He keeps battling. He gets the block in for the first shot. They get the pass back though and they get the second shot and it's just a whisker wide. I collect the loose ball and find the pass down the line to Matt. Matt gets the shot away but it's blocked. I can't get on the seconds. Wolf gets it though. He shoots. It's blocked as well. Wilf on the ball again here and he shoots but guess what, that's block two. This time Wilf passes into the centre to the mat. Matt's back heel doesn't come off but he gets the shot away but that's also blocked. Now Muid's battling here against the number 10, he does well, he gets past him. I think he gets a little nutmeg in here as well but nothing comes of it. Matt's going to take a quick free kick here and it's a good bit of play from us as we pass it around nicely. Eventually we get the chance from it, but unfortunately we can't finish it off and yet again another shot gets blocked. Our five game winning streak is very much at risk here as Matt gets another chance but the keeper just sticks out a toe and saves it. Samir collects the ball from Kai here. He's going to turn and look for the pass down the line to Matt which he finds. Matt's going to give it back to him. Samir on the ball again here and he's going to pass over to Muid, the number two. Muid's going to try to drive forward. It's a good bit of work, he nutmegs this guy but he eventually loses the ball now to so number 10, William, and he's so techy, he's trying to break my ankles but luckily I do enough. Okay, so last few minutes of the game now and we're losing and I've got Wilf just there on the bench so I've got to bring him on because we need the goals so I sacrifice myself, sub myself off but that means no one's man marking number 10 and guess how long it takes him to score. We need goals, bro. We need goals. Mate, I can't leave Wilf on the bench when we need goals. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I found that quite funny. Obviously, he was giving me stress the whole of that second half, but I managed to keep him quiet for most of it. Um, but literally, as soon as I take myself off, he scores. Uh, but we needed Wilf on for the goals, so it was the right decision. Uh, he's here on the ball again, number 10. He passes square, but they shoot high. Big save from Kai there, just letting us know that he hasn't switched off and he rolls forward straight away. Matt's on the ball here, he puts the keeper down and shoots with his left foot to score his third goal of the day. Well done boys, keep playing. Keep playing, well done Matt, well done boys. Full time whistles approaching. And yes, we are going to lose our first game in six games this season. We'd won five before this, but that streak is now over. The official top lads of Litchfield, top of the division, have ruined our big day. First game back with our new kits. We were looking so peng. Unfortunately, we couldn't play well enough to secure the dub. But at the end of the day, football's back. So realistically, we're all winners. What that also means is we're going to be back with fresh new Fiverr side content. So make sure you subscribe to the channel as we look to bounce back with a win next week. I watch players in five weeks. <laughs> now we've got them again. We've got them again. So. Yeah, hopefully this guy's not playing. <coughs> oh, what a terrible game. Well, next time we need a ring, though. Wasn't that bad. <laughs> Wasn't that bad. First game oh, back. Man. It's all good. Not good.